What's going on everyone? Laughing here and today I'm actually releasing my gameplay footage of my live stream last night uh, where I started off in Mass Effect 1, started off in the game uh, and yeah, figured I would release that to all you guys in case you missed it and you wanted to catch up and uh, kind of be more up to date on future streams, which I will actually be doing another stream a little bit later today. So hey, there you go. Um, but yes, please enjoy it. Hit that like button, subscribe to the channel if you want more. As of right now, I am streaming on Twitch. That may or may not kind of change. I might end up going to YouTube for streaming as well. Uh, we'll kind of see. I'm going to give Twitch a little bit more time to kind of see if I can get a little bit bigger of a following over there. Uh, if not, I might just come to YouTube or I'll dual stream. We'll kind of see. Uh, but in the meantime, just keep an eye out for that. Follow me on Twitch if you want to catch the live streams. That'd be much appreciated. Uh, I know, I think previously I said that I was going to have another kind of big Mass Effect video out today due to kind of personal life stuff and things being kind of crazy. Nothing bad. All good things. May that be known. Um, I'm not going to be able to get that video out today. I'm thinking Sunday. To be honest with you, that's kind of what I'm thinking. I'm kind of shooting for Sunday. Uh, it's going to be a pretty be beefy video, to be honest with you. I'm going to be talking about just kind of in general what is Mass Effect uh, for newcomers or people who are just kind of looking for a refresher course, uh, if you will. So keep an eye out for that uh, in the coming days. Should be pretty fun. Um, but yeah, anyway, here's the stream. I hope you guys enjoy it. Thanks. Whew. We are back. And it feels good to be back, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the laughing playthrough of the Mass Effect Legendary Edition. We made it. We're here. It's been a long journey, uh, and I'm just excited. Uh, so here we go. We're going to get right in here. So uh, in a general sense, I am going to... Uh, be playing Fem Shep. We're gonna be Renegade, of course. Uh, I do think that's gonna be fun. It's gonna be exciting uh, and uh, you know important, nonetheless. So um, should be a good, should be a good playthrough. Classified play information requested. Classified. <laughs> Establishing secure connection. Establish that connection, Mass Effect. Secure connection. Beautiful. Confirmed. Um, all right, custom female here. So yeah, we're we're gonna be Storm. Yeah, I thought we were like, like almost accidentally completely bypassed this. Please so good old Storm Shep, Storm Shepherd, storming the beaches with Normandy, SR one. Here we go. It all makes sense eventually. Warning. Data corruption detected. Uh -oh. Please reconstruct profile. And I hate it when my data gets corrupted. Confirm pre-service history. Ah, <sighs> we're gonna say we are Earthborn. I feel like, you know, rough and tumble, you know, salt of the earth. Confirm psychological go. profile. Ruthless. Hmm. Get the job done. My own life to save your fellow soldiers. Uh, oh, Soul Survivor is pretty, pretty sad here. Physical torrent. Yeah, we're going to go. Uh, I feel like Soul Survivor is kind of a good point to be a renegade. It, like, you know, it makes sense then, especially with the whole like Earthborn origin. Um, so that's what we're going to go with, Confirm I think. Military specialization. All right, here we go. Definitely have to go adept. Let's uh, let's be honest. Adept, although Vanguard. Ooh, hold on. Light armor. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna go Vanguard. Uh, I lied. Uh, medium armor, pistols, and shotguns. Hell yeah. Let's go Vanguard. Confirm facial. We're gonna change appearance. Botox is a thing in space, so we'll we'll do that. Space Botox. It's fantastic. It's great. If you haven't tried it, you really should. All right. Hair, makeup, scar. I think that's it. You know what? I think it's as good as this shepherd's going to look. So we're going to finalize it. Profile reconstruction complete. Uh, don't steal my code. If you do, I'll cry. Or, or go ahead. Yes. I confirm. I will not be able to change anything. Identification confirmed. Uh, 
where are you gonna go veteran legendary ammo yeah subtitles we want those subtitles on uh, none all in these defensive powers for themselves or others yeah why won't they use all available talents that doesn't make sense all right let's, let's go let's do this oh it's been probably seven years since i played mass effect one if not longer so looking forward to this it should be good well what about shepherd earthborn but no record of her family uh, dina doesn't have one she was raised, raised on the, the streets, streets. learned to look out for herself she saw her whole unit die on a cruise. She could have some serious emotional scars. I do. Spoiler alert. Every soldier has scars. Shepard's a survivor. Is that the kind of person we want protecting the galaxy? Uh, yeah. That's the only kind of person who can protect the galaxy. Yeah, leave it to Anderson. I'll make the call. I'll make the call. Dude, Anderson is, uh, like the greatest i love captain anderson he, he's he's just awesome i just love him i'm forgetting the voice actor's name i feel horrible uh but he's he's a national treasure he's awesome mass effect feels good getting those chills <laughs> Terrace Prime relays in range, initiating transmission sequence. Commander. Ah, back on the Normandy, SR-1, after all these years. Feels we good. are connected. Calculating transit mass and destination. The relay is hot, acquiring approach vector. It, yeah, it looks pretty good so far. All stations secure for transit. I don't think I chose what mode I wanted in. Hey, looking good. Hey, we did an okay job. Approach run has begun. I swear, like, usually within the first hour, I just, like, hate how my character looks and have to restart three times. So, the fact that I was able to do it in one go, yeah, fantastic. Oh, Joker. Seth Green, my man. Good to have you back in the pilot seat. Thrusters, check. Navigation, check. Internal emissions sync engaged. All systems online. Drift, just under 1500k. Nice. 1500 is good. Your captain oh, will be pleased. Nice. I hate that guy. <laughs> don't worry, you don't, you don't have to put up with him long. Gave you a comp. So uh, Caden too, for that matter. <laughs> you remember to zip up your jumpsuit on the way out of the bathroom? That's good. I just jumped us halfway across the galaxy and hit a target the size of a pinhead. So that's incredible. Besides, specters are trouble. I don't like having them on board. Oh, Call me paranoid. Well, uh, bad paranoid. news. The council helped fund this project. They have a right to send someone to keep an eye on their investment. Yeah, that is the official story. But only an idiot believes the official story. Uh, let's see here. They don't send specters on shakedown runs. So there's more going on here than the captain's letting nice. out. Joker, status report. Just cleared the mass relay, Captain. Stealth systems engaged. Everything looks solid. Good. Find a comm buoy and link us into the network. I want mission reports relayed back to Alliance Brass before we meet. Nice. Aye, aye, Captain. Better brace yourself, sir. I think Nihilus is headed your way. He's already here, Lieutenant. <laughs> Tell Commander Shepard to meet me in the calm room for a debriefing. You get that, Commander? Great. You pissed the captain off, and now I'm gonna pay for it. It's true. <laughs> Don't blame me. The captain's That's a always lie. in a bad mood. Only when he's talking to you, Joker. Yeah, That's a lie. Um, all right. The captain's waiting for you in the calm room. So, let's go to options here. Uh, we'll go to gameplay. Oh, we said graphics. We want that off, and we want that off. Oh God! All right, 
All right, yeah, we're gonna do favor frame rate. Oh, smooth as butter, baby. Ah, oh, here we go. It don't look too bad. Definitely looks better than uh, back on 360, I'll tell you that much. Congratulations, Commander. Looks like we had a smooth run. You heading down to see the captain? I'm on my way to give him a status update so, right now. So buttery smooth, With all due respect, ma'am. Maybe he'll finally tell you what we're really doing out here. Info's on a need-to-know basis, Presley. Just follow the orders you're given. Understood, Commander. Yeah, tell him. Tell him, Shep. I grew up on Eve Prime, Doc. It's not the kind of place Eve to fix him. But there's something I was just telling us about this mission. Chakras! The captain's in charge. Chakras! Come on! Not his choice, Doc. Spectres don't answer to anyone. They can do whatever Good they want. Good to see you again. Gets in their way. Oh, you watch too many spy vids, Jenkins. Aw, oh, look. Salam for the slaughter. Corporal Jenkins. Bye, where's that guy? What do you think, Commander? We won't be staying on Eden Prime too long, will we? I'm itching for some oh, real action. Oh, you'll get some, Jenkins. I sincerely hope you're kidding, Corporal. You'll get your some. real action usually ends with me patching up crew members in the infirmary. Yep. Doctor's right. Only a fool goes looking for a fight, Corporal. Unless it's me. Sorry, Commander, but this waiting's killing me. I've never been on a mission like this before. Not one with a Spectre on board. <laughs> You'll do fine, Jenkins. Just we won't treat bury this like you. every other assignment you've had, and everything will work out. Easy for you to say. You proved yourself on a coos. Everybody knows what you can do. This is my big chance. I need to show the brass what I can do. There's no rush for you to die, young, Jenkins. Corporal. You have a long career ahead of you. Don't do something stupid to mess it up. <laughs> Shepard, worry, always the jokester. I'm not going to screw this up. Uh, always the, the jokester. You have a long on. career Good ahead on. of you uh, with Jenkins. Ma'am? Yes, Commander. Is there something ah, you need? Ah, Chakwas, we good. captain's waiting for me. Goodbye, Commander. We'll talk later. Uh, what up? Controls are kind of weird. might just be my controller, to be honest with you, but... Alright, here we go. Commander he Shepard. Good. I was hoping you'd get here first. It will give us a chance to talk. The captain said he'd meet me here. He's on his way. I'm interested in this world we're going to. Eden Prime. I've heard it's quite beautiful. I've never been there. Uh, but yeah. you know of it. It's become something of a symbol for your people, hasn't it? Proof that humanity can not only establish colonies across the galaxy, but also protect them. But how safe is it, really? Are you trying to scare me, Spectre? Your people are still newcomers, Shepard. The galaxy can be a very dangerous place. Is the Alliance truly ready for this? Yeah. I think it's about time we told the Commander what's really going on. This mission is far more than a simple shakedown run. I already figured that out. Yeah. We're making a covert pickup on Eden Prime. That's why we needed the stealth systems operational. There must be a reason you didn't tell me about this, sir. This comes down from the top, Commander. Information strictly on a need to Everything know basis. Everything's on a need to know basis. A research team on Eden Prime unearthed some kind of beacon during an excavation. Protean. It was Prothean. What else can you tell me? This is Big Shepard. Huge. The last time Gigantic. humanity made a discovery Enormous, like this, say. it jumped our technology forward 200 years. But Eden Prime doesn't have the facilities to handle okay. something like this. We need to bring the beacon back to the Citadel for proper study. Obviously, this goes beyond mere human interests, Commander. This discovery could affect every species in Council space. Mm. Yeah, why did we? Why didn't we keep the beacon for ourselves? You humans don't have the best reputation. Some species see you as selfish, too unpredictable, too independent, even Why did you say the Turdian? Sharing that beacon will improve relations with the Council. Plus, yeah. we need their scientific expertise. Yeah, get them Solarians the on that. We do. The beacon's not the only reason I'm here, Shepard. Nihilus wants to see you in action, Commander. He's here to evaluate you. Uh, let's ask why. What's going on, Captain? The Alliance has been pushing for this for a long time. Humanity wants a larger role in shaping As interstellar they usually do. We want more say with the Citadel Council. The Spectres represent the Council's power and authority. If they accept a human into their ranks, 
It shows how far the Alliance has come. Not many could have survived what you went through on Akuz. You showed a remarkable will to live, a particularly useful talent. That's why I put your name forward as a candidate for the Spectres. Wow. Why would a Turian want a human in the Spectres? Not all Turians resent humanity. Some of us see the potential in species. So bad. Too bad you gotta I see go. what you have to offer to the rest of the galaxy, and to the Spectres. We are an elite group. It's rare to find an individual with the skills we seek. I don't care that you're human, Shepard. I only care that you can do the job. Just tell me what I have to do. I need to but see your skills for myself, Commander. Eden Prime will be the first of several missions together. Several you will be in charge of the together. ground team. Secure the beacon and get it onto Shit. the ship ASAP. Nihilus will accompany you to observe the mission. Yeah, let's go. Just give the word, Captain. We should be getting close to an Eden Prime. Captain, we got a problem. Oh. What's wrong, Joker? Transmission from Eden Prime, sir. You better see this. And bring it up on screen. Better. And that's, that's for sure. Get down! Shaky can, uh, directed by JJ Abrams. We are under attack, taking heavy casualties. I repeat, heavy casualties. We can't get evac. They came out of nowhere. We need. Everything cuts out after that. No comm traffic at all. It just goes dead. There's nothing. Reverse and hold at 38.5. Status report. 17 minutes out, Captain. No other Alliance ships in the area. Take us in, Joker. Fast and quiet. This mission just got a lot more complicated. See how it goes. A small strike team can move quickly without drawing attention. It's our best chance to secure the beacon. Grab your gear and meet us in the cargo hold. Tell Elenko and Jenkins to suit up, Commander. You're going in. Like, I find it weird that, like, Caden's, like, co-piloting, but, like... He's gonna go down there? I don't know. It's kind of strange. Eh, whatever. Engaging stealth systems. Somebody was doing some serious digging here, Captain. Your team's the muscle in this operation, Commander. Go in heavy and head straight for the dig site. What about survivors, Captain? Helping survivors is a secondary objective. The beacon's your top priority. Approaching drop point one. Here we go. Nihilus, you coming with us? I move faster on my own. Oh, we got a badass over here. Nihilus will scout out ahead. He'll feed you status reports throughout the mission. Otherwise, I want radio silence. I don't like putting my life in the hands of a Turian, sir. Nihilus is on our side. He wants you in the spectrum, and he wants that beacon. Ready and able, sir. The mission's yours now, Shepard. Good luck. We are approaching drop point two. Just jumped out early. whatever I want. <laughs> the wind is intense, yeah. For real, it was. Flambeed over there. Oh, is that two? Oh, it was one for one. Okay, it didn't even see me coming. Well, 
he's dead. And uh, let's see how we do this here. Uh, poor Jinx. <laughs> the derpiest face. Rip right through his shields. You're out of chance. Uh, that's a rough butt. <laughs> I feel like such a dick, dude. Uh, forget about him. Leave He's by worst guy. Ah, forget about him. Aye, aye, man. Oh, I'll figure it out later, dude. All right, let's let's go. Meta gel is needed. Yada yada yada. I'm gonna stop doing that. Just burned our buildings here, Shepard. A lot of bodies. I'm gonna check it out. I'll try to catch up with you at the dig site. God dang. Yeah, a lot of bodies indeed, dude. Let's go get Ashley. There she is. I'm just going for a light jog. No biggie. Nice shot. Looks much better. Oh, hey, I can do a thing. Gunnery Chief Ashley Williams of the 212. He the one who charged your ma'am? I need a status report, now. Oh, man. We were patrolling the perimeter when the attack hit. We tried to get off a distress call, but they cut off our communications. I've been fighting for my life ever since. That's rough, buddy. Where's the rest of your squad? We tried to double back to the beacon, but we walked into an ambush. I don't think any of the others... I think I'm the only one left. This isn't your yeah, fault, Williams. Yeah. You couldn't have done Survivor anything skill, to save all them. that fun yes, stuff. That's not very fun. We held our position as long as we could until the Geth overwhelmed us. The Geth haven't been seen outside the Vale in really 200 years. Why are they here now? That's right, Karth. They must have Why come are the they beacon. here now? The dig site oh, is close, sorry, just over bad. that rise. It might still be there. You're coming with us, Williams. We need that beacon. Aye, aye, ma'am. It's time for Amen. payback. Move out! <laughs> you, you first. <laughs> Alright, let's get some let's get some stuff. Yada yada yada. Upgrade kit. Cool. Cool. Is that it? All the fun fun stuff? I thought there was more. Alright, let's go to squat no equipment. Cool. This looks pretty much the same. Oh, light armor. Alright, cool. I oh, already got stuff on there. That's nice. I don't care about that. Alright. Uh, upgrades. Sure. Let's throw some chemical rounds up in this place. Alright. Taking cover behind the rock. I have my weapon out. Why am I doing this?
get him. dedicated melee button now that's pretty handy dandy this is the dig site the beacon was right here it must have been moved yeah, it'd be too easy. our side or the geth hard to say maybe we'll know more after we check out the research camp you think anyone got out of here alive if they were lucky maybe Let's hiding up in out. the camp it's just on the top of this ridge up the ramps up the ramps we go up the ramps we go change of plan shepherd there's a small yeah. spaceport up ahead i want to yeah, check it out i'll wait for you there kind of a sad song let's see here we go to equipment i think i got a new shoddy yes Up the hill. Come on, run up the hill. You can do it. Looks like they hit the camp hard. It's a good place for an ambush. Keep your guard up. Man, those husks look great. Damn, dude. Oh, God. They're still alive. What did the Geth do to them? Oh. Why does this husk have... something over here. Come on, controller. Open. Cool. And it's sort of like character stuttering you see, I think it's my controller. So. Door. It's closed. Security locks engaged. Forgot about this. Ah. <laughs> That's good. Humans, thank the maker. You're welcome. Hurry, close the door before they come back. Don't worry, we'll protect you. Hopefully. Thank you. I think we'll be okay now. It looks like everyone's gone. You're Dr. Warren, the one in charge of the excavation. Do you know what happened to the beacon? It was moved to the spaceport this morning. Manuel and I stayed behind to help pack up the camp. When the attack came, the Marines held them off long enough for us to hide. That's a bummer. They gave their lives to save us. No one is saved. The age of humanity is ended. Soon, only ruin and corpses Jesus will remain. Jesus Christ, dude. What's your problem? What's wrong with your assistant? Manuel has a brilliant mind, but he's always been a bit unstable. Genius and madness are two sides are of the same normal? coin. Is it madness to see the future? To see the destruction rushing towards us? To understand there is no escape? No hope? No. I am not mad. I'm the only sane I one left. I forgot about this guy. I gave him an extra dose of his meds after the attack. Like, he is. I'm gonna leave him alone. I'm not gonna be mean to him. Um, but like, it's such a good like foreshadowing, you know? Crazy. Williams, take us to the spaceport. You can't stop it. Nobody can stop yeah, big it. Big yikes, Night indeed. Is falling. Dude. The darkness of eternity. Hush, Manuel. Go lie down. You'll feel better once the medication. Yeah, I take a rest. Oh, I got Parag. Ah, oh, gross. Can I punch him now? Or <laughs> just kidding, of course. Uh, yeah, that's crazy though. I had no idea of like the foreshadowing. I didn't remember it rather.
Saren. This isn't your mission, Saren. What are you doing here? The Council thought you could use some help on this one. I wasn't expecting to find the Geth here. The situation's Dude, bad. I like how, like, decked out he is already. I've got it under control. Ah. Uh, yeah. Seriously, they, they really did a good job with us game in general I even is back way back when holy smokes dude Just dude, that was that was crazy. Let's see here. Yeah, I thought they're getting rid of more of these mini games. That's kind of fun once in a while, but everybody stay calm out there. We're coming out. We're not armed. Is it safe? Are they gone? We took care uh. of them. Those things were crawling all around the shed. They would have found us for sure. We owe you our lives. Ah, uh, I still can't believe it. When we saw that ship, I thought it was all over. It showed up right before the attack. I knew it was trouble the second I saw it. So we made a break for the sheds. Some, some deets. Tell me everything you remember about the attack. Uh, the three of us were working the crops when that ship showed up. We just saw it and ran. I don't know what happened to the rest of the crew. Yeah, son. They were by the garage, over near the spaceport, right where that ship came down. No way they survived. You don't know that. We survived. If they made it to the garage, they could have had a fighting chance. What yeah, else can you tell me about, about the ship big, you saw? Scary octopus I was too busy running to get a clear look at it. Cuttlefish I think it like. landed over near the spaceport. Tell them about the noise, Cole. That awful noise. Oh, beautiful, it was emitting some deep kind of signal noise. As it, descended. it sounded like the shriek of the mm. damned. Only it was coming from inside your own head. Wow. It was probably trying to block communications. Whatever it was, it felt like it was tearing right through my skull. Almost made it impossible to think. I have to go. Hey, Cole, we're just a bunch of farmers. These guys are soldiers. Maybe we should give them the stuff. Jeez, Blake, you've got to learn when to shut up. If there's something you're yeah. not telling me. Some guys at the spaceport were running a small smuggling ring. Nothing major. Exchange for a cut of the profits, we let them store packages in our sheds. You greedy bastard. You weren't running for your life. You were running to check on your merchandise. No, it's not like that. I just I just knew there were some packages here, something we could use. I found a pistol. Figured it would come in handy if those things came back. But we'll probably get more use out of it than we will. Hand it over and I'll be on my way. Good luck. Well, that was it. And no renegade points. <laughs> it's a horrible renegade run by me so far. Can I have you do that? No. I can't kick, take control of them. Okay. Uh, Alright, well, hey, let's double check equip equipment. Equipment. Let's see. That's what I'm. Oh, it's, yeah, it's medium armor. Come on, man. Yeah. Yeah. Give me that pistol. Cool. We'll go. Go to Ashley, cause Kane's not gonna last long. <sighs>
the same thing. Mm. Alright. Uh, I think squad. There we go. Come on, guys. I gotta move myself. I'm gonna move. I'm gonna move myself down here. There we go. Be bigger down there. All right. Assault training. Intimidate. There we go. Let's get that way up there. Um. Yeah, unlock barrier. There we go. Adrenaline burst. I like it. Cool. Kidding. No one really cares. I uh, will give you first aid. And this, too. Alright, and then... Uh, oh, yeah. Sorry, I'm rusty, as they say. Salt training, let's do this. Do do hell yeah. Cool. I'm a soldier. Alright. I have no idea what I'm doing. This can R1. No. There we go. Let's give me these silly helmets anyway. Let's Let's kick it old school, you know? Give me a leather. A leather helmet and call it good. Uh, just want to make sure I'm not missing anything. I highly doubt I am, but let's. I don't see that. Oh, let's talk to someone. That's lame. Commander, it's Nihilus. It's Nihilus. Damn, son. Turian. Yeah. You know him? Uh, he was my buddy. He's a specter. Then he, he was with died. us. Something's moving over behind those crates. Wait! Don't don't shoot! I'm one of you. I'm human. I like the way you hid behind those crates during the fight. Really helped us out. Thanks a lot. <laughs> I love being Me? a dick in this but, game. <laughs> but I'm just a dock so worker. Fun. I don't even have a weapon. Kept throwing something at him. My name's Pal. You know, yelled a little bit, distracted him, Turian. thinking a bullet for me. Shot him. Things you could have done. Other, the other one. What the hell are you talking about? There were two Turians here. Your friend and another one he called Saren. I think they knew each other. Mm. Your friend seemed to relax. He let his guard down. And Saren killed him. Shot him right in the back. That's a bummer. I'm just lucky he didn't see me behind the crates. Where'd Saren go after he killed Nihilus? He jumped on the cargo train and headed over to the other platform. Probably going after the beacon. I knew that beacon was trouble. Everything's gone to hell since we found it. First that damn mothership showed up, then the attack. They killed everyone. 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 If I hadn't been behind the crates, I'd be dead too. How come you're the only one who survived? Why didn't anyone else try to hide behind the crates? Investigate. They Get out never of that had Sherlock's a chance. Hat. I was already behind the crates when the attack doing started. What? what were you doing? Wait a minute. You were hiding behind the crates before Why? the attack? I. Sometimes I need a nap to get through my shift. I. I sneak off behind the crates to grab 40 winks where the supervisor can't find me. You survived because you're lazy? You ditch work, then you cower back here and do nothing while the Geth butcher oh, everyone else. Be a I don't even have a gun. What was I supposed I to do? Said, run out there and die? Adam. Not that hard. I couldn't save them. Nobody could. It, it was horrible. Yeah, whatever. Let's go. We need to find that beacon before it's too late. Take the cargo train. That's where the other Turian went. I, I, I can't stay here. I need to get away from all this. keep on moving myself a lot but you know I'm trying to find a good spot upgrade kit yeah there we go got some stuff and things on oh, medical kit all right cool all
I see. some details, you know. Oh, wow. That's... I don't remember that. Alright. I guess we get a move on. Where's this gap, dude? this go Hiding. Come on. Oh, fine then. That's how you're gonna be. You can play. But you in character there for a second. There's medical stuff. I saw a crate around. Fatigued. All right. Is that crazy? Did I not actually see a crate? Okay. Oh, I actually have a stamina bar now? What? There it is. Dude, that's crazy. I had no idea. Uh, train control. Dun, 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 dun. I love the music in this game too. It's so good. Set the charges. Destroy the entire colony. Leave no evidence that we were here. He just put on that like little black thing that was on on his head, like this little hood. See Commander Shepard. Alright, we're gonna decide. Demolition this. charges planted. Hurry! We need to find them all and shut them down. Yeah, it should be fine. There's 
a reheat bar there. No big Say like, how are you not dead, dude? Dude, this pistol is like OP. <laughs> Invest all my points in the pistols for now on because I can just like snipe stuff with them. Look how warp does like jack all half the time. Alright. Oh, two charges for me. Where could the last charge be? If I was the last charge... What? Hey, thanks, Sun Fun. I appreciate your support. Hope you have a fantastic rest of your night and get lots of sleep. Over here. Ah, technician kit. I don't really think I need to upgrade a whole lot. But I need a bunch of free stuff on the Citadel anyway. I should be like extra super wrong or something. There we go. Easy description. Here we go. Oh, uh, oh. Uh, too easy. Too easy. Alright, alright. Oh, more easy decryption. Oh, once again, too easy. Recoil dampener. That seems nice. Really, I'm just gonna be dumping all my points into pistols now because pistols are apparently, uh, you know, there's godliness and there's pistoliness, I guess. I know where I'm going. Where? Oh, I'm such an idiot. Everything just looks so nice in this game. I have a hard time knowing where I'm supposed to go. But for real, though, this looks fantastic, oh dude. That's crazy. It's like someone dropped a bomb. That's wild, dude. I don't remember this. That must be where the Geth ship landed. Little do they know, it's not actually a Geth ship. It's actually a Reaper. Damn, son. All right. Oh, don't mind me. Normandy. The beacon is secure. This is amazing. Actual working Prothean technology. Unbelievable. It wasn't doing anything like that when they dug it yeah, up. Yeah, this is a nerd kid. Something must have activated it. Roger, Normandy. Standing by. Oh, he's gonna get sucked in to the Twilight Zone. Don't do it. Don't do it. That's right. Hold, 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 Carthor Nasty real tight. Oh. No, don't touch it. Get it all in my brain. 
It's like a two time use thing, or. Identified the ship that touched down on Eden Prime, the Normandy, a human alliance vessel. It was under the command of Captain Anderson. They managed to save the colony. And the beacon. One of the humans may have used it. Oh, I'm the bad guy. Rawr. I should just like dodge. Kisser dude? Like what? This human must be eliminated. Cool story, bro. Cool story. Doctor? Doctor Chakwas. I think she's waking up. You had us worried there, Shepard. How are you feeling? Not great. Like the morning after shore leave. How long was I out? About 15 hours. Something happened down there with the yeah, beacon, dude. I think. Wish I could it's my fault. Hours. I must have triggered some kind of security field when I approached it. You had to push me out of the way. I Kinda expect better that you, Carl. Lieutenant. You endangered the entire mission. Don't be so hard on him, Commander. We have no idea if that's what actually set it off. Unfortunately, we'll never get the chance to find out. Mm, fair assessment, the beacon Dr. exploded. Chakwas. A system overload, maybe. And the blast knocked you cold. Williams and I had to carry you back here to the ship. What's the damage, Doctor? Physically, you're fine. But I detected some unusual brain some activity. Some beta waves. Abnormal beta waves. I also well, beta waves. I'm a bigger fan of alpha waves, idea. personally. Uh, Science typically associated you know. with intense dreaming. Just kidding. Um, yeah, it was a nightmare. Let's I be saw, honest. I'm not sure what I saw. Death, death, destruction. Nothing's really clear. Hmm. I better I add so. this to my report. It may. Oh, Captain Anderson. How's our XO holding up, Doctor? All the readings look normal. I'd say the commander's going to be fine. Glad to hear it. Shepard, I need to speak with you. In private. Aye, aye, Captain. I'll be in the mess if you need me. Adios, Karth. Sounds like that beacon hit you pretty hard, Commander. Are you sure you're okay? Yeah, I'll feel bad. I don't like soldiers dying under my command. Jenkins wasn't your fault. You did a good job, Shepard. Did we leave Gunnery Chief Williams back on Eden Prime? I figured we could use a soldier like her. She's been reassigned to the Normandy. Williams is a good soldier. She deserves it. Lieutenant Elenko agrees with you. That's why I added her to our crew. Intel dropped the ball, sir. We had no idea what we were walking into down there. That's why things went to hell. The Geth haven't been outside the Vale in two centuries, Commander. Nobody could have predicted this. Yeah, that's fair. You said you needed to see me in private, Captain? I won't lie to you, Shepard. Things look bad. Nihilus is dead. Nihilus is dead. Destroyed. The, the beacon was destroyed and Geth was invaded. Pissed. The Council's going to want answers. The Council can kiss my ass. Yeah. I won't let them blame yeah, me for losing the beacon. I didn't do anything wrong. I'll stand behind you and your report, Shepard. You're a damn <laughs> hero in my books. That's not why I'm here. It's Saren. That other Turian. Saren's a specter. One of the best. A living legend. But if he's working with the Geth, it means he's gone rogue. A rogue specter's trouble. Saren's dangerous. Mm -hmm. And he hates humans. Why? He thinks we're growing too fast, taking over the galaxy. A lot of aliens think that way. Most of them don't do anything about it. But Saren has allied himself with the Geth. I don't know how. I don't know why. I only know it had something to do with that beacon. 
You were there just before that beacon self-destructed. Did you see anything? Any clue that might tell us what Saren was after? Just before I lost consciousness, I had some kind of vision. A vision? A vision of what? I saw synthetics. Everybody died. Yeah, maybe. Slaughtering people. Butchering them. We need to report this to the Council, shall we? <laughs> what are we gonna tell them? I had a bad dream? We don't know what information was stored in that beacon. Lost Prothean technology? Blueprints for some ancient weapon of mass destruction? Whatever it was. Sarah took it. True. But I know Sarah. I know his reputation, his politics. He believes humans are a blight on the galaxy. This attack was an act of war. He has the secrets from the beacon. He has an army of Geth at his command, and he won't stop until he's wiped humanity from the face of the galaxy. Uh, not if I can. I'll find oh, some oops. way to take it. <laughs> it's not that easy. Not if I can help it. Trips. All he can right. go anywhere, do almost anything. That's why we need the council on our side. Uh, yeah, we cool. prove Saren's gone rogue, and the council will revoke his specter status. I'll contact uh, the ambassador that. and see I mean, if we can get us an audience yeah. with the council. It's gonna be hard. He'll want to see us as soon as we reach the city. Let's get to should be the getting close. city. Down. Head up to the bridge and tell Joker to bring us to into dock. The city down. Let's go. Let's do it. If you want to get to it, I feel like that's an actual song. Alright, well, I have some Paragon in me, but, you know, we'll be bad the rest of it. I, we'll try. <laughs> going, like, I haven't played this game in, like, a really long time, and, like, cold going in a Renegade. Oh, that's a little hard. Glad to see you're okay, Commander. Oh, thanks, kid. Commander, I'm glad to see you're okay. I mean, Karth. Losing Jenny I mean, kid. was hard on the crew, and I'm glad we didn't lose you, too. There's nothing we could have done to save him. That's true. No, I know that, but I don't have to like it. It's been a hell of a shakedown, Cruz. Mm -hmm. Our first mission ends with one specter killing another. The Citadel Council's not going to be happy about that. Probably use it to lever more concessions out of the Alliance. Yeah. There's something big coming. I don't want anyone messing it up. You read me, Lieutenant? Five by five, ma'am. Is there anything else before we head ashore? Keep your concerns in check. We don't want to get a rep for questioning orders. Aye, aye, ma'am. Yeah. That's a really nice way of saying shut up. <laughs> shut up, Karth. Yes, Commander? Is there something you need? I you just want go. to say hi, Chakwas. Well, you and I are buds. I'm glad you're Chakwas. okay, Commander. The crew could use some good news after what happened to Jenkins. When your number comes up, it's over. His did. Do you really believe that, Commander? After what happened to you in the coups? Are you saying you only survived because of random chance? I survived because I refused to die. With respect, sir, I think you had somebody watching over you. All right, Ashley. Thanks. I need to go I'm speak go. with Joker. Goodbye, Commander. All right, Ashley. Is Ashley like the most hated? Like Caden's the most like I don't know, I mean, meme done, but I feel like he's like people don't like Ashley, but I still feel like more people choose Ashley over Caden. Strangely enough. Oh, dude, I've never. I don't know if I've been over here. That might sound stupid, but like. Oh. Go so speak to Joker when you're ready. Tell him to bring the Normandy into dock. Yes, sir. Oh my god, my controller. I gotta go get a new controller. Hey, no elevators though. Man. Good old stairs. I love I'm glad stairs. you're okay, Commander. Losing Jenkins is hard enough on the crew. Yeah. Come on, dude. Once again, folks, it's the controller. It's not in good shape. 
Not nice to my face. Good timing, Commander. I was just about to bring us into the Citadel. See that taxpayer money at work. Hell yeah, doc. Here we go. So fast, so sleek. Dude, we're gonna see the Citadel for the first time in a long time. Oh my god. Let's go. That look good. Look at the size bad. of that ship. The Ascension, flagship of the Citadel fleet. Wow, well, size isn't everything. Why so touchy, Joker? I'm just saying you need firepower too. It's true. Look at that monster. Its main gun could rip through the barriers in any ship in the Alliance fleet. Good thing it's on our side then. Citadel Control, this is SSV Normandy, requesting permission to land. Stand by for clearance, Normandy. Clearance granted. You may begin your approach. Transferring you to an Alliance operator. Roger, Alliance Tower. Normandy out. Normandy, this is Alliance Tower. Please proceed to Dock 422. Fast loading screen, dear God. This is an outrage! The Council would step in if the Geth attacked a Turian colony? The Turians don't found colonies on the borders of the Terminus systems, Ambassador. Humanity was well aware of the risks when you went into the Traverse. What about Saren? You can't just ignore a rogue specter. I demand action! You don't get to make demands of the Council, Ambassador. Citadel Security is investigating your charges against Saren. We will discuss the CSEC findings at the hearing, not before. Good old council. Absolutely Captain useless. Captain Anderson, I see you brought half your crew with you. Just the ground team from Eden Prime, in case you had any questions. I have the mission reports. I assume they're accurate? They are. Sounds like you convinced the council to give us an audience. They were not happy about it. Seren's their top agent. They don't like him being accused of treason. Yeah, I'm not gonna sit on my ass just because the council doesn't want to do anything. If they won't stop Saren, I will. Settle down, Commander. You've already done more than enough to jeopardize your candidacy for the Spectres. I do the mission on Eden Prime was a chance to prove you could get the job done. Instead, Nihilus ended up dead and the beacon was destroyed. That's Saren's fault, not hers. Then we better hope the CSEC investigation turns up evidence to support our accusations. Otherwise, the Council might use this as an excuse to keep you out of the Spectres. Come with me, Captain. I want to go over a few things before the hearing. Shepard, you and the others can meet us at the Citadel Tower, top level. I'll make sure you have clearance to get in. And that's why I hate politicians. Yeah, you and me both, dude. Shit. Hack in. Man, you can call me hacker, man. <laughs> Journal. Area map. Ooh. Earth Clan, you are in the wrong place, I think. Your chastising remark. <sighs> I am Din Korlak, Volus Ambassador. Yeah, I'm Is there... Goodbye, Ambassador. Yes, yes. Good day, Good day Earth, Earth Clan. Clan. Fair enough. Fair enough. I can't get in there. Come on. Doors are a little faster. Why are there leaves here? Why are they? What? 
Why? What? Like... Flashing. That's weird, dude. What a... Greetings and welcome to the Presidium. My name is Avina, and I am pleased to be your virtual guide throughout this level of the Citadel Space Station. No thanks. I don't need a guide. Our records indicate this is your first time on the Citadel. A brief orientation session is customary. Please allow me to do my job. I'll pass. <laughs> I apologize if you no. found my service unsatisfactory. I don't want you to do your job. Any complaints in writing to the Citadel Tourist and Visitor Can I? Board. Please, Have though? Nice no. Day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool, cool, cool. Tower, tower, tower. But, look at this. Just look at it. Just look at that and say, would you look at that? Looks good. In a general sense, I think it looks good. Much better than original Mass Effect. How far you can see. Man. But the waters. Nah, that's the water looks looking good. Looks good. Alright. That's uh Oh those water effects. I like that. Rogan statue. That's enough. I've had my office rearranged five times. Oh, why is that? Five times? Why? What do they want? How should I know? It's not like keepers offer next. Oh, uh, the keepers. A scan you keeper person. Welcome. I am Nalina. What up? I don't recognize you as one of our expected clients today would you like me to see when the consort will be able to meet with you sure can't i just go in mm, i'm afraid not yeah you must understand there are many who seek the consort services but if you wish to leave your name she'll make every effort to meet with you what is the consort what does she do yeah, what does mm, she do it's difficult to explain She's many things to many people, and something different for each. Oh, some so seek her for advice, some things. for entertainment, others still for pleasure. Hmm. Most of the time, our clients won't realize what they were seeking until after she has provided it for them. She one of them mysticals? You make her sound like some kind of oracle. No, not in the usual sense. She's merely but a woman. A woman with remarkable compassion and a generous spirit. I suggest you make an appointment and see for yourself. Can't I just go in? Mm, oh, I'm we already not. asked that. But if you wish to leave your name, she'll make every effort. Commander Shepard. Excellent. You should hear something in um, three or four months. Nobody's worth that much of a wait. <laughs> well, that's not for me to judge. I have your name and you'll be contacted. Is there anything else? I think I'm done here. Oh, I well, I hope here. you'll return again in the future. We always enjoy seeing new clients. Nalina. Yes, Shaira? Send the commander up to see me. I wish to speak with her. Oh. Yes, of course, mistress. Alright. Getting spicy, and this is only the first, uh, you know, part huh. gameplay. It appears the consort has taken notice of you. She'd like to meet with you now. Why? <laughs> what does she want to see me for? I don't know. You'll have to ask her yourself. Just head upstairs. She'll be waiting for you. Alright, alright. Let's, uh, let's go see this here consort. Alright. You're with the Alliance? My brother's a private back on Earth. It's okay. He'll probably die. <laughs> so horrible, dude. Uh, it's rough, like, going back to Mass Effect 1 after you've you played out, like, the whole trilogy a few times, you know? I uh, know it's the first time i played it remastered, but... <laughs> very nihilistic outlook on, like, people's fates half the time. That is close enough, Commander. Oh, shit. I've heard shit. a great many things about you since you arrived here in our Citadel. I don't like people spying on me. I apologize, Commander. I make it my business to know when important people arrive on the station. 
Many of them become clients. But that is not why I asked you here. I have a certain problem that could use your expertise. Fair Get enough. to the point. I have a friend, Septimus, a oh, retired Turian this, general. This quest. This is a good I won't quest. discuss the details, but he wanted me to be more than I could be. We had a falling out. Now he spends his days in Cora's den, drinking and spreading lies about me. If you would speak to him as a fellow soldier, I believe he will listen to you and let the matter be. What happened between you? I respect his privacy too much to go into the details. If he wishes to tell you what happened, that is his prerogative. Yeah, why not? I don't make any promises, but I'll see what I can do. Thank you, Commander. That is all I can ask. Appeal to a sense of honor. Remind him of his position so as a general. Get him drunk. Get him excited. If you can convince there him we go. To stop spreading lies about me. I would be very grateful. This is so weird. Like, why are you like? Randomly, kind of like now half I must hugging ask you to take me. Your leave. We just I have met. many clients waiting to see me. This is a bad. What is this? Couch? My couch? How do you get into the couch? Uh, futuristic couches are weird, dude. But there's a couch right here. So then, what is this for? Why is there a hole in it? Why is there a hole in this couch? Why is there a hole in the second couch? And you have this couch. I don't understand. All right, well, keep your secrets. Very strange. Come on. I have to admit, I'm a little nervous. <sighs> All right. Let's get to the. City, huh. You can do it. You can run, Shepard. <laughs> cool. There's another thing over here. Oh, shopkeep. Dude, I love the, the Hanar, Hanar. So great, dude. Ah, human. This one is greatly pleased to see you here in my decadent emporium. Who are you? This one's face name is Delaninder. Though many in this place simply refer to it as Delon. Hmm. Please take time to examine the fine goods it has for purchase, all of great worth. All right. Weird Show me your items. Jelly sack. Show me what you're selling. Oh, this one is pleased to do so, human. You will not be disappointed. Let's use standard items, I guess. That's a. That's a shotgun right there. Holy shmoly moly bully. Just found out I'm poor. I think that's probably important. Uh, well, get it eventually. All right, let's go up, yeah. Oh, keep her up here. And keep her, okay. Very cool. Oh, uh, you gonna talk to me and tell me to do something shady? No? Horrible vibe. What's this? One of the Earth Clan. The tale of how you survived the great tragedy on Akuz is truly remarkable. I am amazed each time I hear it. I don't like strangers keeping tabs on me. <laughs> Forgive me, Earth Clan. My name is Barla Vaughn. My job makes it necessary for me to keep informed. Interesting. I am a financial advisor to many important clients here on the Citadel. 
when someone as important as yourself arrives on the station. Right, bye -bye. I should go. Goodbye, Commander. I don't know. I think he's kind of creepy. I thought this guy had to do with something. I don't know. Alright. Let's go to the place. Oh. Citadel Towers. Nice. Gonna pop open another drink here. Let's go. Oh, good old elevator rides. The council isn't going to ask me these questions, are they? I doubt it. We've made our reports. Now we just have to trust Ambassador Uthi. That's a bad idea. No, we don't, sir. <laughs> All right, with you. Did I fuck What's that up? Bug thing over there? What's it doing? They had me facing the in wrong light of the way. recent attack on Eden God Prime, damn. many colonial investors are pulling their support for future projects. Proponents of expanded human colonization insist that Eden Prime was. It's a skip. It's right. <laughs> literally facing the wrong way. Uh, who's that? Is that Bay? Saren's hiding something. Bay. Give me more time. Stall them. Stall the council. Love Don't Garrus. Be ridiculous. Your investigation is over, Garrus. He looks good. Holy crap! Commander Shepard, Garrus. High risk texture. I was right the there. officer in charge of the CSEC investigation into Saren. You blew it. <laughs> Sounds like you came up empty. Saren's a spectre. Most of his activities are classified. I couldn't find anything solid. But I know he's up to something. Like you humans say, I feel it in my gut. I think the council's ready for us, Commander. Good luck, Shepard. Maybe they'll listen to you. You don't want to keep the council waiting. Dude, Garrus in the first game is so straight-laced. Like, there's a stick so far up, uh there um that he, he can't even sit down the entire first game it's it's crazy but man he, like his character arc is just the hearing's already so started good. come on the geth attack is a matter of some concern but there is nothing to indicate Saren was involved in any way the investigation by Citadel Security turned up no evidence to support your charge of treason. An eyewitness saw him kill Nihilus in cold blood. We've read the Eden Prime reports, Ambassador. The testimony of one traumatized dock worker mm, is so hardly is compelling proof. I resent these accusations. Nihilus was a fellow specter and a friend. That just let you catch him off guard. Captain Anderson. You always seem to be involved when humanity makes false charges against me. Oh, and well. this must be your protege, Commander Shepard. The one who let the beacon get destroyed. You're the one who destroyed the beacon. Then you tried to cover it up. Shift the blame to cover your own failures. Just like Captain Anderson. Yeah, He's dude. taught you well. But That's what can shit. you expect from a human? Ah, fuck you, buddy. You can expect me to kill you the next time we meet. Your species needs to learn its place, Shepard. You're not ready to join the Council. You're not even ready to join the Spectres. He has no right to say that. That's not his decision. Shepard's admission into the Spectres is not the purpose of this meeting. This meeting has no purpose. The humans are wasting your time, Counselor. And mine. Yeah, fuck 
You, you can't hide behind the council forever. There is still one outstanding issue. Commander Shepard's vision. It may have been triggered by the beacon. Are we allowing dreams into evidence now? Kind of How can I defend my innocence against this kind of testimony? I agree. Our judgment must be based on facts and evidence, not wild imaginings and reckless speculation. Do you have anything else to add, Commander Shepard? You've made your decision. I won't waste my breath. It's really the Council has found no evidence of any connection between Saren and the Geth. Ambassador, here. your petition to have him disbarred from the Spectres is denied. I'm glad to see justice was served. This meeting is adjourned. A failed politician. It was a mistake bringing you into that hearing, Captain. You and Saren have too much history. It made the Council question our motives. I know Saren. He's working with the Geth for one reason. To exterminate the entire human race. Every colony we have is at risk. Every world we control Amen. is in danger. Even Earth isn't safe. We need to deal with Saren ourselves. As a Spectre, he's virtually untouchable. Ooh. We need to find some way to expose him. What about Garrus, that CSEC investigator? We saw him arguing with the executor. That's right. He was asking for more time to, to finish to his Garrus. report. Seems like he was close to finding something on Saren. Any idea where we could find him? I have a contact in CSEC who can help us track Garrus down. His name is Harkin. Forget it. They suspended Harkin last month, drinking on the job. I won't waste my time with that. You won't have to. I don't want the Council using your past history with Saren as an excuse to ignore anything we turn up. Shepard will handle this. You can't just cut Captain Anderson out of this investigation. The Ambassador's right. I need to step aside. I need to take care of some business. Captain, meet me in my office later. Mm, I bet you do. Harkin's probably getting drunk at Cora's Den. It's a dingy little club in the lower section of the wards. I thought you said he was a drunken loser. Couldn't hurt to go talk to him. Just be careful. I wouldn't call him reliable. You and Saren have a history. What happened? Yeah, About 20 out. years ago, I was part of a mission in the Skillian Verge. Skillian I was working with Saren to find and remove a known terrorist threat. Saren eliminated his target. But a lot of people died along the way. Innocent people. And the official records just covered it all up. I saw how he operates. No conscience. No hesitation. He'd kill a thousand innocent civilians to end a war without a second thought. So would I. Howard's I should go. Him. Good luck, Shepard. <laughs> I'll be over in so the, the ambassador's office if you need anything else. So wild. No, I wasn't. Never mind. <laughs> uh, can I help you? Um, yes, is there something you want? Why are you so interested in the Keepers? Keepers? I've got no interest in the Keepers. Don't get coy. I know what I saw. I, uh, I'm not so sure I should be talking to you about this. We're just talking. Is there something wrong with that? <laughs> no. I guess it wouldn't hurt to tell you. I'm using a small scanner to gather readings on the Keepers. So far, I've had mixed results. I find it difficult to get near the creatures. Why were you being so secretive about it, though? Yeah. Well, technically, we're not supposed to disturb the Keepers. I don't really think my scanning disturbs them, but the authorities might disagree. I'd like to do it more openly, but it's not really worth getting arrested over. I can help you out. I'm not worried about the authorities. Why are you doing I don't even know who you power, are. Though. I'm Commander Shepard with the Alliance Military. Just tell you who I am hmm. and uh, aided a well, bit. I, I suppose I could use the help. You'll need this. It's the scanning device I developed. Activate it each time you see a keeper. All collected data will automatically upload to my database. I'll even send a few credits your way for each unique scan. 
What are you doing with the data once you've scanned it? Trying to learn whatever I can about the Keepers. We see them working everywhere, yet we know so little about them. I'm a scientist. I want to know what makes them tick. I should get going then. I should. Yes, I have much work myself. So long, and good luck with the scanning. Shaman's Club. That's her. Adventure out here. Are we good now? Yes, we are. It's kind of a bummer. Like you can only go here in one game, and that's it. I got business here, but not with you. But not with you. Piss told us to take you down if you showed up. What are you waiting for? I'm standing right here. This is Fist's only chance. If he's smart, he'll take it. He's not coming out, Rex. End of story. This story is just beginning. Yeah, I agree. All the fucking Rex. Out of my way, humans. I have no quarrel with you. Yeah, what was that all about? I won't either. Who knows? Let's just try not to get caught in the middle. bothering you, General? I've seen a lot of horrible things in my days, and there's only one woman in this damn galaxy that helps me forget it. So if you feel that way, then why spread lies about her? Because she rejected me. Me! Septimus Araka, General of the Turian Fleet. Some general? What kind of example are you to your troops? The troops can kiss my leathery backside. All I wanted was to retire and be with her. Look, kid, I appreciate what you're trying to do, but don't waste your time. You need to start acting like a general if you want to beat this. I spent all my life acting like a general, and what did it get me? Huh? No, those days are over. I'll just be what I am, a tired, lonely, worn-out soldier. You're a damn general. Quit your whining. Ha! You got balls, kid. There are only five people in this damn galaxy who talk to me like that. So you think it's that easy? Just straighten up and uh, sure. act like a general. Yeah, why not? I don't think it could hurt. Huh. Maybe you're right, Commander. Shaira's worth the effort. Even if she won't have me back. Now get up and get moving, General. All right, I'll go to her after I've had a cold shower or two. Say, you're a bright kid. Would you be interested in earning a few extra credits? What do you want me to do? There's an Elcor diplomat out there who believes Shaira gave up his secrets. Why does he think that? Because I told him. Look, I just need you to convince him of the truth. Why can't you tell him yourself? Well... The last time he saw me, I... I was disparaging his ancestors and... shouting his secrets <laughs> in public. Take this data pad. It shows where I got my info. It will exonerate Shaira and convince the Elcor. 
Who am I taking it to? And where is he? His name is Zaltan. He's an Elkor diplomat. Well, here's to soldiers acting like soldiers. Oh yeah, dude. Thanks, Commander. You know, you might make a good general yourself one day. Hard to imagine a general like that getting so upset about a woman. That's because you don't understand. <laughs> I don't know how that means it means anything, but. Sorry, I'll get to you when I can. Like one to one. Uh, oh no, I guess it's not the only one. Damn, dude. Dolphins are wild. Hey there. Sweetheart, you looking for some fun? No. I gotta say, that soldier get up looks real good on that body of yours. Jesus. Why don't you sit your sweet little ass down beside old Harkin? Have a drink. Let's see where this goes. Jesus, Harkin. I'd rather drink a, a cup of acid ball. after chewing on a razor blade. You trying to hurt my feelings? You gotta do better than that. After 20 years with CSEC, I've been called every name in the book, princess. Call me princess again and you'll be picking your teeth up off the floor. Now tell me where Garrus is. Okay, okay, just relax. Garrus, you say? <laughs> you must be one of Anderson's crew. Poor bastard's still trying to bring Saren down, huh? I know where Garrus is. You gotta tell me something first. Did the captain let you in on his big secret? Just tell me where Garrus is before this gets ugly. But it's all related, don't you see? The captain used to be a specter. Didn't know that, did you? It was all very hush-hush. The first human ever given that honor, and then he blew it. it. Screwed up his mission so bad they kicked him out. Of course, he blames Saren. Says the Turians set him up. Why should I believe a drunk like you? Fine, yeah. ask Anderson. I bet he tells you. He's too stupid and proud to lie right to your face. Just tell me where Garrus went. Garrus was sniffing around Dr. Jesus. Michelle's office. She runs the med clinic on the other side of the wards. Last I heard, he was going back there. I'm oh, out of here. That place out. Yeah, go, go. Get there. We'll get there. Uh, yeah, sure. We'll do it. Oh, yeah, dude, dude, just a lamb to slaughter at this point. Uh, yeah. Do you go to care that much about Ashley? Do that for the rest of you. Overkill. That's actually pretty good.
over over here. Let's scan this bad boy. Here we go. Obsidium. That's awful. All right. Looks good. I locked this. Right, now where's the Destiny Ascension? Where is that? That ship. Naughty, naughty ship. No. Okay. Keep your secrets. Scan this keeper. Get to money. I didn't tell anyone, I swear. That was smart, Doc. Now, if Garrus comes around, you stay smart. Keep your mouth shut or we'll... Who are you? Let her go. Damn, son. That's a good shot. I smell trouble. Shooting in this game is much tighter. Perimeter clear. Okay. Get that medi gel. Uh, talk to Mr. Perfect Garrison. timing, Shepard. Gave me a clear shot at that bastard. You took him down clean. Sometimes you get lucky. Dr. Michelle. <laughs> Jesus are you Christ, hurt? dude. Yeah, I got lucky. No, hey, I'm Doc, okay. how you doing? Thanks to you, all of you. Why were they threatening oh, you? Garris, Who did they work dude. for? They work for Feast. I, Garris. They wanted to shut me up, keep me from telling Garrus about the Quarian. The Quarian? What Quarian? A few days ago, a Quarian came by my office. She'd been shot, but she wouldn't tell me who did it. I could tell she was scared, probably on the run. She asked me about the Shadow Broker. She wanted to trade information in exchange for a safe place to hide. Shadow Broker. Where is she now? I haven't heard that. I put name her in, in a contact with Fist. He's an agent for the Shadow Broker. Not anymore. Now he works for Sari. And the Shadow Broker isn't too happy about it. Fist betrayed the Shadow Broker? That's stupid, even for him. Saren must have made him quite the offer. The Quarian yeah. must have something Saren wants. Something worth crossing the Shadow Broker. She must have something that proves he's a traitor. Did the Quarian mention anything about Saren or the Geth? She did. The information she was going to trade. She said it had something to do with the Geth. She must be able to link Saren to the Geth. There is no way the Council can ignore this. Yeah, let's do it. Time we paid Fist a visit. This is your show, Shepard. But I want to bring Saren down as much as you Absolutely. do. Absolutely. I'm coming with you. I don't need a Turian shooting me in the back when I least expect it. Hold on. Hold on. Folks. All Turians are not the same. Hold I'm not like Saren. It'll be good. I couldn't find the proof I needed in my investigation, but I knew what was really going on. Saren is a traitor to the Council and a disgrace to my people. You can come along, but I'll be watching you. You know, we aren't the only ones going after Fist. The Shadow Broker hired a Krogan bounty hunter named Rex to take him out. Yeah, let's grab him. Yeah, we saw him in the bar. A Krogan might come in handy. Last I heard, he was at the CSEC Academy. Let's go get him, dude. What's he doing there? Let's saddle up. Hell yeah. Fist accused him of making threats. We brought Rex in for a little talk. If you hurry, you can catch him at the Academy before he leaves. Move out.
I said it's kind of it's kind of cute, like how small uh, your squad is in Mass Effect One. Oh, there it is. Looking kind of potato like. We'll blame PS4. It's okay. Raised. I swear, that's weird. No, oh well. It like, uh, if I'm being harsh on the game, uh, like I'm being harsh on the game. At the end of the day, I love Mass Effect. There's very little remaster or remake could do to make me not like it. If anything, really. Uh, that being said, like because I love it so much, I I tend to be harder on it. Than, than not. I, you know, I, I just want it to be the best. So, there you have it. Hey, I know you. You're Shepard, right? I saw the monument at Akuz. They got a whole section about you there. It's a miracle you survived. Looks like you have a fan. I'm sorry. I just never thought I'd meet someone like you in person. Uh, my name's Lang, Officer Eddie Lang, Citadel Security. It's an honor to meet you, Commander. What are you doing down here in the wards? Anything I can yeah, help you with? I, don't care. I have to go. Right. You're probably real busy. Well, see you around, Commander. Yeah, this is true. Extremely busy. Ah, uh, still a beast. I'm out of here. Alright. Whoa. A Solarian excavation team has run into an unexpected problem after unearthing a Prothean dig site. Oh. Hanar protesters have blockaded the dig site, claiming that artifacts of... Times, good times. Hmm. Ah, uh, there's my lovable Krogan. Witnesses saw you making threats in Fist's bar. Stay away from him. I don't take orders from you. This is your only warning, Rex. You should warn Fist. I will kill him. You want me to arrest you? I want you to try. <laughs> uh, I love Rex, dude. Go on. Get out of here. Yeah, you told him. Do I know you, human? I'm going after Fist. I don't want you getting in my way. Huh. Now I recognize you. <laughs> Commander Shepard from the Alliance. I recognize you. Heard a lot about you. We're both warriors, Shepard. Out of respect, I'll give you fair warning. I'm going to kill Fist. Fist knows you're coming. We'll have a better chance if we all work together. My people have a say. Seek the enemy of your enemy, and you will find a friend. Hell yeah. I think we're gonna get along just fine, Rex. Let's go. I hate to keep Fist waiting. Same. Got rid of those humans real fast. Alright, alright, alright. Shield boost. That's important. All weapons. Man, dude, that's good. That's gonna be helpful. Let's get this going. Keepers around here, I can smell them. Okay, Jimmy, let me get this straight. Your business partner, Sorbo, threatened. Okay, where's the really? Am I going to say, do I not smell a keeper? What is going on? Ah, there he is. Ah, I told you. Nose never lies. Let's put the 
guns away. All right. Well, uh, hey, I uh, want to say thank you guys for watching. Uh, I seriously appreciate it. Uh, once again, this is just part one, so I'll have some more parts out uh, later. Uh, so keep out an eye for those. And also some new Mass Effect videos coming out uh, tomorrow. Besides just the stream, I got another one coming out, which is exciting. And uh, if you missed the one that I put out uh, today, or now I guess yesterday, definitely check that one out too. If you haven't already, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated. Uh, do something good for yourself. Have a fantastic rest of your day. Uh, and as always, take care.